An illegal takes out a Grand Rapids Wyman and dumps her remains on the road. This is she, a young, beautiful girl named Ruby Garcia. Again, these open border policies destroying uh, mainly the BIPOC community, right? I see a lot of problems now in the Black and the Hispanic community because of their, for whatever reason, whatever need that they have to have more people in this country that look like them. I don't understand that. I'm from LA and I can tell you that that's, that's what they wanted. They wanted, even, even, even my Asian friends, okay, well, technically he's an Asian friend who got hooked up with cheap hooers in Mexico. And that's why he supported mass migration into this country. He was part of, oh, he's 5'4", no wonder he's angry. Good Lord. An illegal from Mexico popped off a Grand Rapids, Michigan woman on Friday and dumped her on the side of the road. Br Brandon Ortiz Vite was charged with papawing 25-year-old Gar Ruby Garcia and leaving her remains on the side of the road. Ortiz Vite faces one count each of homicidals open, taking people out, carjacking, uh, felony firearm, illegally carrying a concealed weapon. Well, hold on, hold on. Wasn't there a judge that granted migrants right to carry? Huh? Even though we don't even have any ability to charge them for anything because they don't have a social security number? Even though they can repeat offend and just claim they're somebody else? So that they don't have five strikes, six strikes on their records. I'm a different person every time I get in jail, get out of jail. You can't charge me for a second strike. You can't do three strike law me, right? Operating while intoxicated and driving on a suspended or revoked license. I think you mean no license. He's not legally here. Garcia's family did not disclose the relationship between Ortiz Vite and Ruby Garcia. It is unclear when Brandon Ortiz Vite illegally entered the U.S. He had a prior arrest in 2020. RNC Research Press, this is Brandon Ortiz, an illegal charge with pow powing a 25-year-old Grand Rapids, Michigan woman and leaving her remains in the side of the road. Another horrific consequences of Biden's open border. Now, they like to blame it on Biden. I'm blaming it on all the liberals, okay? They voted for them. It does not matter who the president was. Uh, they would have done. They would. They would. Have, they would have left the border open, and all the liberals will be. Oh, it's okay. Welcome to America. We need to print a bunch of money to give these, to these people who hate us, anyways. That's funny. Like you thought that he would. You thought these guys were just gonna come into America and go after whites only. Clearly, they're not. They went after torta Mexicans as well. 